News Channel 7, severe weather first. Legendary screen actress Raquel Welch released a new book this spring. But before she became an author, she made a long list of movies, including one of the most violent roller derby films ever produced, Kansas City Bomber. Well, it turns out her stunt double lives in the North State. KRC on News Channel 7's Eric Nacton caught up with her today. As tough as most professional wrestlers, Judy Arnold of Reading has been on a roll for nearly 50 years. I started skating in, um, whoa, 1962. And whether she was on or off her skates, growing up around guys, fighting just became second nature. I had a older brother, younger brother, and my younger brother, I kind of raised him, kind of, and uh, I beat him up so many times. I was not a nice sister. When he came, became 15 and I came home from a trip and I heard his voice and looked at his hands, I thought, I'm his friend now. You know, I didn't want to get beat up by my brother. <laughs> Instead, Judy took her aggression out in the sport of roller derby. Probably one of the best teams that I skated with when I was young was the San Francisco Bay Area Bombers. We had some tremendous gifted skaters. Arnold also competed on the East Coast in front of thousands of fans. I became the captain of the Philadelphia Warriors and for probably uh, eight years we had great crowds there. When we'd skate at the Spectrum, we'd have 16,000 people come. That was the early 70s. Her skills in roller derby led to the opportunity of a lifetime on the silver screen. I got a call one morning uh, from my boss, roller, the roller games boss, and he said, we're making a movie with Raquel Welsh. And I'm like, wow, that's great. You know, I was excited. And he said, and we've ch chosen you to be your double. I'm like, are you kidding? The movie was shot in Portland, Oregon over the course of a month, Arnold did all the stunts for Raquel Welch. I had to wear a wig and I have short hair always so I can see peripheral vision is good and then you got this wig on with hair all not only on the sides but it, when we filmed they asked me to keep it in my face you know they didn't want you to know that it wasn't Raquel. Whether she could see or not Judy says she was definitely starstruck. Meeting Raquel was like whoa you know this is a star you know and I was a star in my own right but only in Philadelphia New Jersey so to be a star all over the world it was a thrill to meet her. And whether it was on the silver screen or real life competition Arnold says she had no problem being physical. No I had no problem with that. I think the um, WWF or whatever it is learned from us. <laughs> Arnold lives in Shasta County and helps out with the Reading Roller Girls. This Saturday they're going to host Chico at 7 o'clock at night at Big League Dreams. Money raised will benefit breast cancer. The Chico Wildcats softball team in Hawaii tonight hopefully getting rested and getting ready for the NCAA West Super Regionals.